Now to an update on renaming schools in Jacksonville that are currently named after Confederate leaders. We've told you before uh, that process is expected to cost between $750,000 and a million dollars just to rename them. So News for Jack's digital reporter Travis Gibson is joining us in the newsroom with uh, where the fundraising efforts stand on all of this. And Travis, uh, it sounds like there's still a long way to go. Yeah, there really is, Ken. Um, we checked today, and so far only $7,800 have been raised towards renaming those schools. The Jacksonville Public Education Fund started the crowdfunding campaign to allow the public to give tax-deductible donations. So far, 66 people have done that. Now, Duval Schools says the name changes are expected to cost between $750,000 and $1 million. That will go towards helping to pay for things like signage and new athletic gear for all the teams. The Education Fund is waiting for the school board's final vote on the name changes. After that, it plans to get the word out about raising some more of that money. Now, let's take a look at the schools that would need to be renamed. They include Stonewall Jackson Elementary, Jefferson Davis Middle, and four other public schools. The fund played a similar role when Nathan Bedford Forest High School was renamed Westside High in 2014. Now, renaming the schools has been met with resistance from some alumni who say the schools honor important historical leaders, but those who support the move and would like to donate to the fund can find a link inside of this story. For now, I'm live in the newsroom, Travis Gibson, Channel 4, The Local Station.